I think uh, I'm not quite sure right now. I have to analyze that what really went wrong because we did improve getting to the free throw line. We improved our rebounding. Didn't make three point shots. That was pretty obvious that we needed some threes and we didn't have that, especially against the zone. Um, but overall, I think we just had a letdown. I mean, we, we played really well in our previous two games, um, and I think we just had a letdown, unfortunately. We have a, an inexperienced team, and we're just, we're just inconsistent. Uh, to be determined. It's still too early to decide that. Um, I do I think we have talent? Yes. We just have an experience, and it's just going to be determined about how the team decides to take ownership. We have some, you know, just people need to take some ownership in themselves and decide to make some changes. If they do that, yes, we can do that. If they don't, then, you know, it's on them. You can't make somebody do something. Oh, it was a lot. I mean, we're just lacking experience. Last year we had five seniors, or so we had a lot of experience. This year we have a lot of uh, newcomers, so it's basically a new team put, stepping up to new roles. Um, but that being said, I mean, they're capable. It's just, you know, we just didn't come focused today. What, what do you think was the reason for that? I'm actually not quite sure. Um, maybe it's just a letdown. We, we really kind of gave it all, our all in the last two games when we traveled to Bimini. It was, a, it was quite a trip. Um, and obviously, going back right to classes, we had a, we came in around like 10 o'clock on Sunday, went right to classes, and I just think it was a quick turnaround for us, and we just didn't bring the energy we needed. Anybody else? Well, it seemed like throughout the game, you guys were breaking the press really well, and that was sort of a positive spot for, for you and your team. Um, but once you guys broke the press, it seemed like the pace was sort of off of you. Yeah. Uh, going forward, especially in the game, how do you think you can shore up that pace and maybe continue to break the press in the future? Yeah, I mean, I told my team, when you break the press, you have to score. You're not breaking it to run a play because it's not stopping the press from coming back, again, the next possession. So I mean, we're just working on our wings, feeling comfortable attacking with the basketball. We had layups. We just we hesitated and pulled it right out. So I'm just we're going to work on that. And then um, on defense, it seemed like in your full court transition, you guys were doing really well. It seemed like in the half court you guys were struggling on defense a little bit. So uh, just going forward, how do you think you can improve your half court defense and maybe continue to uh, maybe the Yeah, I mean, I have to look at that a little bit better because I think, um, yeah, there are some things. There's usually a guard that's going off on us in, on a game, so I've got to figure out why that's happening. Um, I am proud of the way we ran the, the, our, our press, our zone press at the end. We really haven't worked on that, so that came out of the woodwork, and I'm happy they could apply that. Um, but yeah, I just think that the def defensive, like, I don't know, just being a stance, the ball pressure just wasn't there. We gotta make shooters dribble. Uh, just as a, just a last question. Yeah. Um, so obviously, maybe not where you guys wanted to be at the start of the season. Um, and so just what's the message going into the locker room, going into the rest of the season, specifically when you guys start playing against uh, league teams? Yeah, I, mean, I think this game was um, a letdown for us, unfortunately. I think the, the matches in the locker room, previous losses, was a little different than today's loss. Um, again, we're really focusing on ourselves, and I just felt today we didn't come ready to play. It, it really, I mean, I thought they played well. I thought Howard played, did a great job. But that aside, I thought we didn't show up. So it's really about us and figuring out why we have the inconsistency. I think this year's team really, truly does care about each other on and off the court. But I think what we're learning is um, holding each other accountable, calling each other out, not being liked by each other for a minute on the court is, is not a bad thing. That's how you get better. And we're learning that right now because we're all so close and we're all such great friends. Um, and we have to learn that on the court's on the court, off the court. You leave what was on the court off the, you know. When you're off the court, you forget that, moving on. But on the court, we got to hold each other accountable and be a little more tougher on each other. Thank you very much.